Greetings, humans, and life form. CJ here, and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Black and White. In the last part, we captured Verusion in one of my shortest episodes ever, besides the first episode of Crystal, which I don't look fondly upon. And in this part, we actually go continue the adventure, and today is winter! Hell freaking yeah, it's winter, guys, which is perfect because the area we are going to, which is Twist Mountain, is fully accessible to us during the winter. Which is wonderful. Guess what, guys? I didn't even plan this. <laughs> I just knew it was coming, and it did. Which is great. I think I think the beginning of August starts winter. Well, at least in Pokemon Realm. I guess I would call it. So really, how to get to Twist Mountain is just go northwest, northeast as possible. On Route 7. And just head on up here, which is where we got HMO3 Surf. And we can continue into Twist Mountain, which is pretty cool. Conquer the mountain for 20 years, oh my god. So yeah, recently I have restarted um, Ocarina of Time 3D, and I am playing through Master Quest right now. It's actually, it is decently harder, I have to admit. Um, the, the enemy placement's more jerkish, the item locations are way different. Like, where you find the slingshot in the first dungeon, it's really different. Um, everything's mirrored, of course, um, except for the towns, I don't think. Yeah, I haven't noticed the towns being mirrored or, at all. Or are they? I don't even know. All I noticed, really, is that the Decker tree is very crazy. Razor shell here. Yes, yeah, so that's what I noticed so far. I heard that there's a lot more silver rupee puzzles, which will be spectacular, horrific, whatever. So, continuing on with the game, stupid, um, guy is stupid. Die. Goodbye. And level 38, good. Nice. Oh, Encore. Um, I don't want to get rid of anything for that. Keep old moves. Give up on Encore. Okay. I also did some research recently with my friend. We actually just tested some stuff out. And later on in the game, not to spoil anything, there are some cutscenes that take place on both the top and bottom screen. And you miss a lot if you don't see both screens. So we did some experimentation with it. And we figured out that it is possible for me to show them both. So we will do that. Which will be nice. So don't you worry about that. Hiker Terrell is dead. We murdered him. Um, uh, should I? I'm not healing. Okay. I think I might switch out first because there are a lot of fighting and rock types in here. So yeah, I should keep Duck One out then for the fighting type, I guess. So into Twist Mountain. It's pretty weird music. Oh my God, no, it's Calic. I'm only calling him Calic now. The Fuyuki part's kind of unnecessary, but, you know. And Clay, too. What a surprise seeing you here while I was inspected to Twist Mountain. The two of you seem a bit more rugged than the last time I saw you. A little bit, anyway. Is that so? By the by, you folks seen the Team Plasma crowd lately. After all the trouble, we gym leaders met up and had a chat. We've got no clue who, where they are. It's like they're hiding under a rock. We have not much to do but wait for them to, make, to move. Anyhow, there are none of your concerns. Squirts like two, you should just enjoy traveling and that Pokemon. Explore the fine place, it's beautiful. And fun stuff to do. Well, I better just see myself in on your business, bro. Feel free to train yourself for my girl. I think he just had an orgy. Uh, okay. I thought he was going to get us involved with all of that bother again. Ew! So it was bracing myself. Ew! Charin Cal. Whoa! Dude, I'm going in. Ew! Okay, note to self, stay away from Cowlick. I think he's a homo. Of course, not like there's anything wrong with that. But, still, I I'd rather stay. Uh, actually, I, I, screw that. Screw that comment, whatever. That was just the girder I killed it with Duckhorn after several annoyances. So we're gonna heal right up here, and I noticed during that battle that I really have to take a shit, but whatever. <laughs> I probably shouldn't have said that, whatever. Uh, lemonade, because we don't need that anymore, actually. Okay, fully healed Duck 1, and also fully healed Whiskers, so we're good. 
Let us conti continue. So amazing. Okay. So yeah, as you can see with the snow here, you can actually access a lot of areas, like right here. Normally you can't, see this little mountain thing right here, normally you can't go across this. But because the snow is piled up, you can. And we can go into this cave. And get into a random encounter. Actually, I want to show this. This is a wild cub chew. Cub chews are an ice type Pokemon. They are little cubby bears with snot bubbles. Um, essentially, you can only find them here during the winter. I think you can find them here during autumn or something, but they're extremely rare. I don't remember exactly. But um, they're pretty cool, I guess. I'm just gonna kill it, and then I'm gonna actually stop the recording for a minute and go take a poopy. Because <laughs> I just realized how bad I have to do it. Okay, I probably shouldn't talk about that, but whatever. Fire Blast! Endure. Endure. Yeah. Oh my god. Why'd you have to endure? Why did you have to endure? Okay. So it's dead. It's dead. It's dead. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, guys, we'll be right back. Okay, note to self slash any new slash future ill peers. Always go to the bathroom before you record. Always, even if it doesn't feel like you have to. And always cut out random encounters. Okay, I just ran from that. That was a boulder. I don't really care. <sighs> Why do I have a feeling this isn't going to be as bad as the trek to um, Verizion? And I'm ignoring that right there. This, I, th I believe, is actually a shortcut near the end, which is odd. Another stupid boulder. I don't really care. Another random encounter. Don't really care. Hey, just in case you wanted a boulder on your team, you can catch one here. Okay. I think this area is actually optional. So I ran my counters if I had a... Okay, that was a cub chew. I just I ran from it anyway. Finally, someone that I can actually fight and show. Original Pokemon in the Miami, whatever. I like Twist Mountain because it's actually pretty cool. The depth perception of outside is really cool. The thing about it is, when you go inside the caves, you get bombarded by random encounters and that's the thing I don't like about it better than charge stone cave because you can actually go outside and then like stop as I mentioned the doctor is outside which is really cool so that way you can just heal there and then just actually get to where you want to go without having to run back to him and heal five seconds later but we have to fight him of course first which we haven't seen yet so we're gonna have to go outside and do that well I'm, I want to go outside and do that no, it's pretty obvious why. Die, Crocorok. Crocorok. Crocorok, you don't belong in this world. Mine does. Duckwan, level 36. Pretty cool. Palpitode. Makar, you got this. I've been training things a little bit unevenly recently, so I'm going to have to go maybe do a little bit of off-screen training, something like that. I don't know. You know, I'll, I'll catch everyone up. They'll all be like level 40 by the time we get to the next gym. Um, quick joke about the next gym. What happened for, with me was that, um, I w in, my, in my white game, when I was playing white, I got up to the, the seventh gym. Like, I was right in front of the gym leader. I didn't save yet. And then my game froze. Like, it glitched the hell out. And then I had to re, re, um, I had to turn it back on. And it put me back at the beginning of Twist Mountain. So I was like, Mother! Mother 3, Lucas! Oh my god! It's a good game. <laughs> I never really played it, just saw it. Speaking of which, I'm trying... I was actually considering doing a blind LP of Twilight Princess. I've actually never played that. I'm... As far as I... Uh, what I know about the game so far is that... You know, like, the generic, you turn into a wolf crap. And then I watched the first ten parts so far of Josh Jepsen's LP of it. Um, of course I'm talking during this random encounter. So, it's not, probably not a good idea to use, uh, yeah, sure, whatever. So yeah, um, that's all I know about it so far. Um, if anyone watches this before, I don't know. All I'm saying is I might do it, I might not. If anyone saw that, that was... A giant stick. Not my, no, don't, no, no, not like that. Whatever. <laughs> and item. TM90 substitute. 
Pretty cool, pretty cool. Speaking of items, let's turn on our dowsing machine just in case. And not quite get out of here. I hear it's Bulldor season. They're quite abundant this time of year. So finally out of that. Good. A lot of hidden items around here, especially during the winter. Here's a max potion. Pretty cool. I'm going to use the dowsing machine to get all we can right here. It's right there. Rare candy. Only get that during winter. Pretty cool. There should be some more around here as well. Uh, oh, something up there. Right there, Stardust. Pretty cool. Let me just find the doctor. Let's find the mo There he is. Just fight him so we can heal up whenever the hell we want. As you can see, there's an item right over there. There's a lot of stuff we can do around here. Mostly just explore, do some trainer battles. But there is one little door we have to go through to actually continue here. And during the winter especially, I always forget where the hell it is. Which could be a problem, but probably not too bad. Don't worry about that. Futcher sight. It's a Futcher! To the Futcher! As I like to call future Futcher. Fut your Futcher. Futcher. Whatever. Flutter! Musharno. Let's actually switch to Croco for this, because Croco hasn't actually been used recently. Ba -ba -dow. Guitar riff. And Musharna seems like a pulsing maniac. Uh, crunch. Bite its head off. Nom nom nom. See, see, look, look at that defense. That's crazy. No critical hits and no future eye sight. Future eye. Future sight because I am a dark type. And thank you. Good. Croco level 32. Awesome. Dr. Hank. Okay. Hear me. Thank you. Health is always crucial. It really is. I had no idea that staying alive was necessary to stay alive. Thanks for the tip, Doc. Let's just go grab that item. It is an ether. That was totally worth it. I'm going to go show something off real quick. See that little door down there? Well, we're going to go down there real quick. Um, if you just make your way all the way down to the bottom of Twist Mountain. I think you can only do this during the winter. Well, first, you can talk to this guy. You can talk to him in the after game, and he will give you a fossil to revive a Pokemon. Which is pretty cool. Stupid Cub Chew. I'm still going to show this because I was talking during it, but I'm not going to fight it. I'm just going to run. Because, honestly, fighting random encounters to run this point in the game is kind of useless. <gasps> Surprisingly enough, that was a Woobat. Get in the door. Okay. Right here is pretty cool. You can find a new Pokemon here called Cryongol, Cryognol, whatever. It's a giant ice... It's a snowflake, essentially. And it's pretty weird. Um... But if you see that giant glowing rock in the center, this is where, if you had an Eevee, you can actually evolve into a Glaceon here, if you had one. Of course, you can trade one over in the after game, which is how you're probably going to do it. And not uh, get into an enemy counter. That'd be fun if we couldn't. Okay. Please. Thank you. Now we can continue up here, hopefully, I think. I swear I don't remember where the hell to go. Not in there. That's unnecessary areas. I'm trying to remember where the hell to go. If there's an area that you can only get to using the snow, it is unnecessary, and I'm probably not going to show it. There's some areas that I already did show, like the um, fossil guy and the glaceon thing. But besides that, I don't. Th I'm not going in there either. Wait, I think there is a TM you can get here during the winter only. But I don't think I need it. I'm trying to remember what door you go into to actually continue. I'm thinking it's this one. Probably wrong, though. Actually, no, I don't think I am. Did I mention I hate Cub Chew now? Down there is a hidden trainer in the dirt or something. Okay, these Cub Chews are getting a bit too abundant. 
if you ask me. But why would you ask me? You'd fight this guy instead. I think this is the right way. I, I'm not exactly sure. I'm probably, I'm probably not going the right way. This just mountain is so twisty. Swirly. No, no quoting. A swoobat. That's pretty nice, I guess. This thing is bound to be extremely freaking fast. So let's just switch over to Croco after I burp there. But, like, hide it, I guess. Go, Croco. I don't know. Foster's Home for Mountain Friends was the best show ever. But now that it is gone, and has been gone for a long time, I don't know. Amnesia, the dark descent, even though you're a psychic type. Like, if I were to have a dark type that can learn amnesia or something, I'd name it descent. So it's amnesia, the dark type descent. <laughs> be pretty cool. Shut up, dude. Do I have any repel? I don't think I do, but so I'm not gonna check. Moonstone, how freaking useful. Random encounters, how freaking useful. Okay, now I really hate cup shoes. Get me out of here, get me out of here, get out of here. Yes, thank you. This is still the wrong way, I think. Or not. No, it probably isn't, actually, now that I think about it. Oh, I shouldn't have fought, fought him. I don't need to fight him, so why did I fight him? Oh, my God. Two Pokemon, and they're probably Baldur and Girder, I'm assuming. Because Baldur and Girder are so freaking abundant that we have to use them, don't we? So, let's just switch out of Duck Horn. Why is Duck Horn even out front anymore? I don't know. Everyone's level 38 besides Red Imp, Croco, and Duck Juan. Um, My best bet is probably Whiskers, though. So, Whiskers, you're up. With your unicorn horn. Nice little unicorn. You prancing mystical beast. Razor Shell. And Sturdy will keep it alive, of course, because... Oh, no, I guess not, because I didn't do enough damage, did I? Because it's a rock type, and it has extremely high normal defense. It has, like, a nose or something. And yay! 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 Excadrill. Oh, yeah, he doesn't have... Duck uh, Whiskers, you're staying out, because you are our starter, after all. Um... Razor shell again, I guess you could try that. For the ground type, of course. Very nice. The buy extra drill. Worker brand. It's a natural brand of worker. Into this door. Door. Encounter. It was a cub chew. I actually went ahead and killed it with um you know, the quant. Come on. No! Okay, this is actually worse than the, uh, on the way to Verizion. So this area was entirely pointless, except for to fight this trainer. Being friends. Yeah, good for you. I'm assuming it's a good fight, I hope. Vanillish. Evolution of Vanillite. Vanillite, not Vanillite. Switching time to Red Imp, because my car can't handle an ice type. It's not a phoenix or anything like that. By phoenix, I mean, of course, um, ho -o. Or, we'll trace, or whatever. Um, Fire Blast! Use happiness. Japanese symbol for fire always saves the day. Look at Red Imp's sprite. He's so fabulous. Gotharita. Let me switch, actually, to Croco. I actually still find it amazing that I happened to get a team of three females, three males, just to keep everything even. Kind of happy it worked out that way. Wondering why my audio keeps shifting like this. It's because I'm moving from left to right around my camera. I, pro I think I've realized I've been a little bit too loud recently. I think it's because I'm putting my face straight in my camera. Just so I can see the screen better. Either way. 
Duo Sion's dead. Proco level 33, which is pretty cool. And back to Gotharita because she switched, because she's stupid. And it's still gonna die anyway. Frisk, oh my god. No, I'm not at the airport. <laughs> Speaking of the airport, my um, grandparents just actually left today. I guess pretty nice. Like, I mean, I know it's mean to say, like, oh, my grandparents, they better get out of here. The thing is that they're kind of annoying, and if I were to record, they'd be like, who are you talking to? What are you doing on the floor? Oh, my God. I'm like, I'm recording a video. Can you please leave my room? Like, what are you doing? Like, that's what would have happened, so that's, that hence the lack of recordings in the past few days. Stop using flatter... I'm using Crunch anyway, it's not gonna help me. The special attack rate is... Flatter is essentially Swagger, except instead of, um... Normal attack being raised, it's the, uh, special attack. So this is- this route is entirely freaking pointless, just so you can fight this person. Okay, I am checking if I have a repel. Which I don't think I do. No, not- not medicine, wouldn't be there. Mm, I have never put in my fossil yet. Okay, no, we can't do anything. I will show off the fossil soon enough. When I have time. And by time, I mean remember to do so. Okay, I'm going to ignore that fight as much as I can. The thing is, in this video, I just want to do as much as Twist Mountain is possibly tolerable for one video. Because I just don't like this place. I just want to get out of here. Honestly, I could just I could just do the whole thing in one video and I'm thinking I'm gonna do that because honestly twist mountain is a bitch Heikle 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 Hiker Daryl Daryl Okay, um, I'm gonna actually take it out with duck horn because it's probably the best bet to do Because you know don't want to share the XP if I don't have to and I actually managed to do so also a boldor, of course you have a boldor. Why wouldn't you have a boldor? I mean, you are in this cave, aren't you? Whiskers, I know you're higher level and you don't need to level up anymore right now. But, instead of Makar, because Makar's also going to level up soon, I'd rather you level up a little bit. Even though Red Imp is going to be the star of the next gym. Spoilers, it is an ice-type gym, if you couldn't tell by all of the icy areas around here. Because this is like the main... The, when, when it's winter, this is the one place you go. Because you know for a fact that this place is going to be affected. This is like the one place that really changes in winter. There, there are other places, such as the next city we're going to. You can actually get some other items there during winter. A gird... Garpy darp, garpy darpy darp. Uh, duck want again. Because fighting is weak to... Flying, not to mention Doug Quant needs some experience. So let's do that. Go girder, 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 man. Or something like the sort. Garder died. The end. Okay. Hiker Derail is dead. Daryl, whatever. I just, I don't know. Quoting things that were popular a while ago. Um, that worked item. Full heal. Don't really need it. Have I ever used my Castillo Cone yet? I don't think I have. I might have, though. I don't remember. And here's the worker from the beginning. What are we doing back here? I guess we can just get on over to the doctor right now if we need to. I'm probably going to do that, actually. In fact, I am doing it right now as you speak. Okay. Yes, yeah, screw it. I'm doing all Twist Mountain. As much as, my, as, as much as my camera can take, I guess, would be the correct way to put it. I think we actually have to go in the area where the doctor is. I'm assuming that is the right area. Like we just missed a door or something? Yeah, I think. I'm not going for that item down there unless I really can. Because I don't want to risk, you know, you know, wasting time. And by wasting time, we've been fighting stupid trainers for an item, but even though we're on our way here. And it's an extra drill, so we get some nice EXP, I guess. But Duck Hunt can't fight it because Duck Hunt is a noob, even though she is awesome. But still, Makar, I guess you can get the experience for this one. 
to be good, I guess. Home claws. What are you? Is it Oh, speaking of which, I think I might have mentioned this already, but I was an idiot and deleted the file on Heart Gold I had with all the event Pokemon to transfer to here, because I'm really freaking stupid. Um, I might have another game with it. I might have my platinum might have it. I think I did that for my friend. Hopefully, he doesn't mind if I use it. I don't know if they. Had, I don't know if it has it. I'm hoping it does because I want to show off those things. Of course, they're not necessary for the game, but if I could show it off, that'd be great. It's like the event to get Zoroark and stuff, and that'd be great if I could actually show it. And Zorua, of course. That's really all there is. PP up. And random encounter. The thing is, this second half of the recording after I went to the bathroom is actually up to 23 minutes now, which um, I can assume is going to be, most of it is going to be cut out because of the, you know, um... Random encounters. I think we go in here now. Pretty sure we do. Oh, we were in here already. Come on. Now which way? I guess this way. After a random encounter. So I'm assuming, yeah. Yeah, so I'm assuming that most of this video will be cut out because of the fact that random encounters are annoying. But yeah, I think now... Yeah, we already did this. But please just make it actually work this time. Come on. Come on, random encounter. Ah. Okay, my camera decided to stop recording right there. Rightfully so. My camera's like, dude, you're retarded. Why are you doing this? I'm like, because I, I need to do it eventually, and I want to get it out of the way now. Wait, is, this is where we started. Why am I just going in a loop? Oh, my God. I, I, so I just came out of there right now. I'm actually gonna just use the, the um, snow to get to a lower level, I guess. Cause honestly, this is ridiculous. I can't imagine why this is taking so long. Hmm. Like the thing is, it has to be an area that is connected to another area by the uh, the path, or else it wouldn't make any sense. We just we were we we got we went in there to get there, so. I'm assuming here. If I could make it in there. <laughs> Happy editing, future me. Wow. Okay. A nugget. Wonderful. Okay. God damn. Okay. Okay, apparently I'm the stupidest piece of crap in the world, and I just had to look into my guide of black and white to figure out what to do. So turns out I'm really stupid. Well, of course, we knew that already. But, yeah. So, essentially what we're going to do is go over here. Right here, I believe. Nope, wrong. WRONG! Let me out of here. Thank you. Apparently right here. Okay, I was right. Okay, so apparently the way to get through here in the winter is easier than not in the winter. And apparently I don't know how to do so in the winter. I'm an idiot. Let's just kill this thing for the EXP to get Duck 1 to level 38 and then finally freaking end this part. Because I need to really, really badly. Because this episode is going to be really freaking long. Razor Wind. I don't... Oh, hang on. Um. Uh. Screw that. Keep old moves. Give up. Okay. Finally, level 38 duck one. Let's switch out. Because honestly, Duck One is not good for the front of the party here. Okay, I think my best bet would actually, for now, be because because Red Imp and Croc are the only ones that need to level up a little bit. Is I'm pu putting Croc up front. Run! Wow, two freaking steps. Thanks. Finally, come on, come on. Okay, we're here. Finally, Cowlick. Oh my God, that's the exit. 
Huh, pretty strong. But you're only strong because your trainers are controlling Pokemon. So if you want to set Pokemon free, if that's what you want, you should start with your own. But taking people's Pokemon by force is not right. That is not real strength! Hey, you, there you are. You should head for the tower now. Get this. Bye, whatever. Control over Pokemon. That's right. We must force order of wrong, Lord N. Whatever. Those guys, they don't know what they found. Gem, whatever. Power. I'm gonna stay here. Train. Asshole. Yes! We're out of here. And we are now in Icarus City. And here's Cedric. Hello, Chase. How is Croc Rock? Oh, this Croc Rock has really taken a shine to you. Pokedex is important, but time spent having fun together is also important. Say, I just had a thought. Have you heard of Dragon Spiral Tower? Well, now I have, I guess. Really quite impressive. Okay, give this story a listen. Dragon Spiral Tower is said to be the universe region's oldest building. Stories say it's the place where the legendary Pokemon came to life or where they remain in deep slumber. I know it's just pack past Icarus City, but that is all I know about it. That's all anyone knows because no one has ever been inside my daughter my daughter my daughter my daughter has wanted to investigate the tower for a long time what there's something i don't know that kind of feeling is pure adventure and i'm not too old for some adventuring anyway i'll go i go have any anyway, away i go to have a look catch you later okay finally so if you like this part subscribe to me here on youtube i don't see why you would because this is a cr crap load of encounters and subscribe, yeah, subscribe to me here if you like this episode. And if you want more content updates, go to my Twitter at twitter.com slash slash cjiggylps. L-P-S. Of course. And you can follow me there for more content updates. And the next part is hopefully not as long. And we actually do some crap here in Icarus City. And hopefully get towards the 7th gym or something. See you guys next time.